Hello, everybody. Welcome to a special edition of Data Movers, JSA's video uh, series and podcast where we are interviewing all of the latest uh, digital infrastructure future leaders. And we are here in Cannes, France, uh, Data Cloud Global Congress. And I am here with the founder and chair of the Data Cloud Talent and Tech Program, as well as Aina McDarby from Microsoft, UK construction lead at Microsoft, um, who is a mentor in the Talent and Tech Program. So we're going to give you a little intro into the program in the impact that it's having in the digital infrastructure industry. So first of all, on that note, Susanna, could you just give our viewers who might not be as familiar with it a little intro into the program? Yes, thank you so much for having us. I'm very grateful for JSA team to actually help us behind this initiative, which is targeted to promote the opportunity for young talent who is interested in AI or cloud or data center may not know how to take their first step. So JSA definitely is the first screen, I would say, to get involved in this initiative. And behind that, Data Cloud has a very successful conference with numerous executives, and we have some today joining us, uh, to actually genuinely educate behind the scene about how data center is being designed, uh, how it's being constructed, how it's being operated, and all the different folks that uh, work in the life cycle of the data center. What we like to do for the Talent in Tech initiative is to allow them to submit the application. If they have less than two years of experience, we welcome them for a full delegate pass. We gave them a special reception, and they also get a chance to meet wonderful people in JSA who help them about the industry, because what you guys do are very inspiring. And indeed, it actually addresses the gap that we had, that we need more younger generation leadership in this data center industry, as we've been around for a long time. And you take a look at how AI is actually taking off, and all the folks that basically are embracing the AI first is actually the young generation. So. We like to pave the way forward and uh, really, really grateful uh, for JSA support to help us to get the word out. Excellent, thank you so much for that intro. We've been interviewing a few um, of the people in the Talent in Tech program, the students in the program, and they all have such amazing things to say about Talent in Tech, so clearly it's making a huge impact. And so, Aina, I'm curious from your perspective as a mentor in the program, what are your uh, impressions of the program so far and uh, you know some of the, the younger folks coming into the industry? Thanks, Candice, and uh, thanks, JSA, for your time today. Um, so my impression today with Talent in Tech has been uh, that it's a fantastic effort and it's great to see the enthusiasm, especially from some of our emerging talents. Um, so today we spoke about um, different career paths. There was a lot of discussion around sustainability, the AI revolution, and particularly around transfer of skills. So we have people from consultant side, constr contractor side, and also owner client side. So uh, I was very happy to talk about my career journey in the DC industry. And uh, basically, my focus point in my day-to-day -day job, uh, how we manage construction safely across the UK portfolio, and everything involved are behind the scenes with the AI revolution. So um, very happy, again, to share that story today with the, uh, the emerging talents. So thanks. Absolutely, thank you for that. And, uh, and one other way that we've been uh, collaborating with Susanna Cass is that you are an author in Greener Data, and we actually have a copy here if you want to show that. So this is Greener Data Volume 2. Greener Data is a, a book series that we've launched at JSA, and every two years we have a new one coming out. It is bringing together all of the top voices in the digital infrastructure industry, talking about what they're doing and their corner of the industry to make our data more greener and to you know bring more sustainability into their companies. So. Uh, um, Susanna has been uh, one of our uh, collaborators and partners, and um, maybe you could just uh, say a little bit about your experience so far. Thank you. Thank you for the opportunity again to collaborate with JSA and the audience like yourself. The unique thing about JSA is they're very innovative. And uh, so even when they pull together the Greener Data Volume 2 book, it's just the approach they take is extremely innovative. So instead of actually having one author wrote multiple chapters, they actually seek out the voices in the industry that touches on different parts of sustainability. As we all know, when we actually build a sustainable data center, we really do need to have a village of different people that think differently. So in addition to the inclusiveness, but we actually have 50 plus authors that JSA assembled, that each of us actually have our voices. 
And uh, it's a wonderful way for folks that doesn't understand about data center or what is sustainability, where to start, uh, for you to actually get to know the author in addition to the content. Uh, so just really good job. Thank you so much, and thank you to all of our viewers for being part of this special edition pop-up uh, video here from Data Cloud Global Congress, where Talent is Tech is clearly making a huge impact on the younger folks coming up into the digital infrastructure industry. Happy networking, everyone.